PC Perspectives coverage of CES 2015 is brought to you by Logitech. See the latest gaming peripherals at gaming.logitech.com. Hey everybody, Ryan Shroud here with PC Perspective. We are at the MSI booth at CES 2015 looking at this notebook. This is the GS30 Shadow. It's a 13.3 inch 1080p notebook. Uh, it has a 4870 HQ processor in it with Iris Pro graphics. Fairly thin. It does have USB 3.0 support. A nice laptop actually, but this has one really special unique feature. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and uh, shut it down here real fast. If you look at the back, there's this little slot here that actually holds quite an interesting little addition to uh, the feature set of this. This is a base station, and if you notice here, um, the laptop will, oh, did I turn it back on? Nope, there it goes. It will sit in there like that, and then you simply pull this lever and lock it in place. Now what you've noticed is you've docked this laptop through a PCI Express 3.0 by 16 connection to this station that you can then turn on. Inside this uh, base station is a 450 watt power supply and uh, a full retail or a full uh, desktop GTX 980 graphics card. And you can see we've booted up into Windows here. So essentially what we have is a 4870 HQ processor with a docking station that supports not only graphics, it has a speaker system up front, it has USB 3.0 ports, audio ports on this back, uh, and obviously power for that. Now this monitor does get disabled while you are using that currently. Uh, but you now have the full gaming power of a desktop GTX 980 that you can keep at home while you take the GS30 Shadow laptop with you out into the world, wherever you're going to be, traveling for school or for work, and you don't miss out on that gaming power with your single uh, PC with this. This will be available starting this week. Yes, Josh points out there is a room in here for a hard drive as well, so you can get extra storage in there. It'll be available like basically this week in January, um, somewhere in the 1999 range uh, as I look for verification. Um, so look for that. We hope to get one of these in really soon to test, and uh, you'll see more of this at PC Perspective. Thanks, guys.